In this video, we'll look at dividing a cubic using synthetic division. So the cubic given is x cubed minus 7x minus 6, and we're dividing it by x minus 3. All right. Well, when you're doing synthetic division, you take the factor, but you use its zero. What zero corresponds with this factor? The opposite sign, or what makes this bracket zero? A three. So we're going to use a three, that is the opposite of this factor, and we'll put that into our synthetic division box. The box is made up of the coefficients of the thing we're dividing, the dividend, in this case x cubed minus 7x minus 6, but be careful, the coefficient here is 1, but you absolutely must put the coefficient of x squared. What's the coefficient of x squared? There are no x squareds, so you need a 0 here. What's the coefficient of the x's? Negative 7. And finally the constant, negative 6. So we set up our coefficients, especially if there were any missing, we put a 0. And now let's do synthetic division. Here's how it works. Start by bringing down the first coefficient. Just comes down. Write it here. Next step, multiply. 3 times 1 is 3. Now add. 0 plus 3 is 3. Synthetic division is going to repeat those steps over and over. The multiply and the add. Here it is again. Watch. 3 times 3 is 9. Put that here. Now add negative 7 plus 9 is 2. Now multiply. 3 times 2 is 6. Now add negative 6 plus 6 is 0. And we're done. Look how quick synthetic division is. I mean, we have to write our answer. And it's important to note this 0 is the remainder column. This 2 is in the constant column. These are the x's. And these are the x squared. I always count from the right side to make sure I have the right spots. And remember that the rightmost thing is the remainder. So now I have my results. I can just state my result. It doesn't ask me to go any farther. Therefore, if you take x cubed minus 7x minus 6 and divide it by x minus 3, the answer you get is 1x squared, or just x squared, plus 3x, plus 2. If it were asking you to factor, you'd go further, and you could factor this, but it doesn't ask that. It just says to divide the cubic. So when you're doing synthetic division, all you do is take the 0 corresponding with the factor, put it in front, bring that first coefficient down, and from there it's multiply, add, multiply, add, multiply, add. And then finally, make sure when you read your results, remember that the very rightmost number is in fact your remainder. And that's it. We've divided a cubic using synthetic division.